Oh my howdy hi, it's Mushy! And did you know there's a brand new update in Brookhaven? First of all, there's a new house that anybody can build. And at the same time, there is a brand new hotel. I am so excited and I can't wait to check all of these out. But before we do that, definitely make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe so you'll never miss another one of my new videos. Let's go check out the modern house first. We're just gonna try this vacant lot and let's see. There's a bunch of homes right here, but I think it's probably all the way at the bottom. <gasps> there it is right Right there. I'm just gonna go click on it. I think it's a brand new modern estate. Well, let's head in. Look at that. <gasps> it even has my name. Ahoy, mushy. Woo. Whoever made this house is so good at building homes. Whoa, ho, ho, you guys. I almost thought I was gonna fall through the floor, but this is so cool. These floors are see-through and then you can look through downstairs to another room. I don't know what's down there. It looks really neat though, but whoa, let's take a look at this massive living room, you guys. So you could just kind of kick back and relax and watch TV at the same time. Okay, well, I'm done with the cute little puppies on the TV right now. Oh, we can use the computer. There's lots of fun things here. This could definitely be my office. And I can make mushy videos here, make Brookhaven videos. Um, These are all the buttons that are kind of standard that come in a house. So excited. I really, really like this. I love the architecture and this is a really nice open kitchen. Okay, let's head over over here. What's this? <gasps> it's a bedroom. Did you know you could sleep in a bedroom? There's the bathroom. Okay, great. You can go do your business right here. I'm curious. What's back here? It's a lovely, nice little backyard. Maybe you could go in there from the inside. Well, I see. It's an elevator. This is great, you guys. There's even a balcony. And from the balcony, you can see into the bedroom. Okay, I better have some curtains there if I'm going to sleep there. Wow, this house is huge. Mungus. <gasps> There's even a jacuzzi. Oh my Oh my gosh, I love this house. We're gonna continue. Oh, that's a private balcony for this bedroom. That's gonna be my bedroom, you guys. I'm claiming that one. Another bedroom right here with even more beautiful views. I think this house is ridiculously big, but I wonder what's over here. Look at this. It looks clickable. Did I what? Did you guys see that? There's a hole in this wall and it just appeared and disappeared. I wonder if it has to do with the plant right here. So if I click this, oh my gosh, huh? I'm not fast enough. Okay, hold on. Maybe if I stand here and click. Oh, wow, this is where the safe is. You guys, this is awesome. Oh no, I'm stuck. I feel a little claustrophobic. Help me. Well, this is good to know that you have your safe and now I'm rich. This is wonderful. Uh, spreading out all the money to the solid zero people in this room. If you click on the button, then you can head back out. But now there's one little problem. I didn't close the safe. Just in case someone breaks in. So this is the living room floor and we're gonna head down one more and <gasps> it's a basketball court inside of my house. I can't believe it. Wait, can we make a basket? Oh man, maybe I could try it again. Come on, let's do this. I really just want to make one goal. That would be really super fun and awesome. Come on, come on. Well, I can practice a lot more, but I don't have to show you guys all of this. One thing I can do is just sit in these chairs and let other people do the work. <laughs> Lonely mushroom. There's basketball, fun house, and pool. This is a basketball court, but what happens when I hit the fun house? This entire room just changed into a fun house. How amazing is this? I love this, so colorful and so much fun. And that's why it's called a fun house, of course. I want to go down one of these slides. Let's head through here. There should be a slide right here. Yeah, let's go. We. Oh, man, that's so disappointing, you guys. Yes, it is. Pretty fun. I really love getting lost in here. And I think this is a great place to play some hide and seek with other people. Well, now that we've tried the fun house and the basketball court, maybe we should see what happens when you hit the pool. I just got teleported back into the elevator. That's not what I wanted. This is so cool. It's a cool pool. Get it? We can swim in here. Okay, I can't believe I just said that. As if you didn't know we could swim in there, of course. But there's also a diving board. Whoa, look at me jump. <gasps> this is great, you guys. But not only that, that's the low diving board. How about we jump from all the way up here? I'm gonna jump. Wee! Oh, I just hit my head on the ceiling. <laughs> as long as I'm a Roblox character, at least I can't pass out. This area feels a bit cramped, but it does make for a long slide. Let's see if we can actually slide down this thing. Hey! Oh man, I'm stuck at the bottom of the pool. Can somebody help me? I think I'm done right here. I think this was the entire tour of the house. I think it's so awesome and I absolutely love it. But this is not the only thing in the update. There's a lot more. Like... 
a hotel. <gasps> Whoa, I don't know if I want to head into the hotel when it's nighttime and the moon's out. It's just giving me creepy vibes. I think what we have to do is go look for the North Estate. Wait, someone already built one. Then I don't have to build my own. We could come check it out. Thank you, Nayplay20, for making this hotel. The first thing I see is a very sparkly, beautiful fountain. This is something my parents would never let me do in real life. I could do whatever I want in this game. Anyway, this hotel is called The Drake. There's a vacancy. <gasps> All right, let's go check it out. Ring the doorbell. Hello? Can someone let me into the hotel? I just want to check it out! Hmm. Anyway, I, I don't think anyone is here. Well, that's kind of stupid because it says there's a vacancy. Okay, maybe we can try and create our own in the South Estate. Or maybe we can break in. <gasps> let me try it, you guys. I'm not sure if this is something that has been fixed in an update where you can't glitch into other people's homes anymore. I made it in, you guys. Okay, are we in this hotel illegally? Maybe. But are we going to have fun? Definitely. I can't wait. Hello. I'm glad there's vacancy, but I think if you own this and you click on it, you can say there's no vacancy available anymore. There's a server's bells for rooms 11, 12, 14, and 15. <gasps> wait, where's room 13? I wonder if there's a secret room in this hotel. What's the story behind all this? I don't know. I love the lobby of this hotel. There's even a fire and... <gasps> wow, there's a pool. Let's head over here. <gasps> I have to swim in this pool, you guys. And there's no one here. It's totally private. I love this hotel. If we're standing here, then there's a bunch of different floors right there. It's maybe the breakfast room? <gasps> That's just the best thing ever. I love it. There's even a cart. Okay, that's it, you guys. There's too many things that I just cannot do right here. So I think I want to go create my own house. I'll have to glitch back out. Maybe if we go to the South Estate, I'll be able to build a house right here. Here it is, the hotel. Okay, I'm going to click on it. Let's go. Oh my gosh, it's being built, you guys. Let's see if we can give this hotel another name. Let's call it the Mushy House. Wow, it actually works. Okay, I do want to change the color of it because Mushy has to be red, of course. And maybe we can change the color of the entire hotel. I wonder what happens when we make this red. So fancy looking. All the curtains have become red. Okay, I think this looks absolutely amazing. Let's head in. <gasps> wow, this is looking great. Okay, now if we hit on vacancy, we can say there's no vacancy. <gasps> Yay, this is amazing and it's so pretty. If you want to build it yourself, by the way, you definitely have to have the estates pass unlocked or else you can't build this hotel. But I know there's people that maybe don't have this pass and want to check out the hotel anyway. So here's your chance. We're going to discover it together. I want to go upstairs here. <gasps> wow. You can walk an entire circle. Okay, never mind. You can't. You can jump over and walk a circle. That kind of works. I love these little areas where you can sit and chill. But I definitely want to check out the rooms. Of course. This one is room number 12. And it's called the Sapphire Room. Wow. It's luxurious. It's absolutely gorgeous and stunning. I have never been so excited to be inside of a hotel. This is amazing. I love this shower. Look at that. Look at these tiles. I wonder how much all of this costs, you guys. You can even... <gasps> I sat in a bath. Ah! Uh, I'm, I'm a totally normal, cool, chill mushroom, you guys. Don't mind me. I'm checking out the rooms. That's all. Okay, I absolutely love this bed. It feels soft and cuddly and cozy. And what about right here? There's windows. Oh, wait. What happened? <gasps> now nobody can see in. I have full and total privacy. <laughs> I literally have no plans on anything except for sleeping right now. Don't worry about me. I might get a little creepy every now and then. Hello? Hello? Okay, nothing happens when you hit the service bell. At least nothing yet. Maybe something will in a little bit. Okay, let's head over to the other room. This is the emerald room, number 11. In the same type of room, but now everything is emerald green. I think I like this one a lot better, it, but it does make me super curious about the other two rooms. Let's just hit the service bell here too, just in case it does something. <laughs> there's no staircase in here. <gasps> what if there's a fire? You guys, I'm a little scared. You can't use the elevator during a fire. The ceiling is red. That's great. Look at how incredibly gorgeous I look with this color. Woo! 
enough self-appreciation. Let's head over to room number 15, the royal room. Whoa, this one is really cool, but it's a little less colorful than the other rooms. This is probably my least favorite room out of all the ones right now. Wait, 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 wait. We do need to hit the service bell again. Yes. And now let's head over to room number 14, the rose room. Oh, that's absolutely gorgeous. Everything is pink in here. Yay! I love it. And I also think the pink looks great with all these flower patterns. I wonder which one of these rooms is your favorite. Definitely let me know in the comments below. And now we're gonna hit the service bell again. And well, I don't feel like taking the elevator. I'm just gonna jump down. Whee! All right, that was fast. Let's see if oh, we could get the food cart. <gasps> this is great! There's service bells in the rooms. A uh, 14 is the last one that I hit. And this is the one that's still ringing. But they do stop after a while because I definitely hit... 11, 12, and 15 as well. Let's just head over to the rooms and deliver some food. The Sapphire room first, room number 12. Hello, food delivery. Um, Here you go. Wait, wait. I, I just want to deliver some food at your table. Why can't I deliver some food? I can sit at the table right here. Oh, that's just wonderful. Hello, food delivery. Ah, it's looking great. All right, enjoy your meal, you guys. That's just wonderful. Let's just continue on to the next room, the Emerald Room. Oh, gorgeous. Hello, sorry, I forgot to knock. Well, there's no one here anyway, so that's a good thing. Okay, let's deliver some food right there. We definitely have to move over to the next room, but before we do that, we gotta go get into the elevator. Top floor, you guys, the Royal Room. The very important food delivery, because if you don't get it on time, it's gonna be cold. All right, here's a T-bone steak. And uh, what did I hear? You wanted some waffles as well? Okay, it's about to fall off the table, but we're heading over to the last room. The Rose Room! Yay, my favorite. Uh oh, I don't think I can say that it's my favorite to the customers, of course. It's got to stay a secret. Okay, anybody? Tacos and burritos? Like, this is a whole party. They just ordered everything, you guys, and some T-bone steaks. There's only one person in this room? Me! We did all that we could in this hotel room. Or maybe there's one more thing hear a little birdie whisper in my ear something about a secret i think if we head in the elevator and go all the way down somewhere in this corner should be able to what i fell down i fell down okay hold on hold on hold on hold on i'm panicking uh, breathe in and breathe out Ooh. I'm in a secret underneath the hotel. Like this is a safe room. Wow, you guys, I can grab this. Wait, what is that? <laughs> There's a little piece of pool right here. That's so funny. We can actually swim in this room. Whoops. Well, it's a little glitchy, but at the same time, super funny. This is great. I love it. Look at all this money that we can steal from the hotel. Oh, never mind. We're not stealing it. This is my own hotel. But that's okay. Let's close this door just in case someone else finds the safe and then it's time to head back out okay we could just climb up the ladder Whee, i'm stuck what's going on what's going on you guys oh there's a button right there what mm, okay if you click it then you can actually get out this is great who would have thought there would be a secret room in the elevator i can't believe it you guys i am so incredibly excited and there's even a cute little garden <gasps> wow you can eat food here tacos and burrito if we head out here <gasps> Look at that! There's Lake Madison! This is the best view of a hotel ever. I think it's a great location. First of all, it's looking absolutely stunningly gorgeous. And secondly, someone built the amazingly awesome modern estate right there. If you enjoyed getting to see all these brand new things, definitely make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos, and thank you so muchy!